Hey, what's up? Just got back from the gym. Just got these today. They are the Minimus, uh, New Balance Minimus UX 200 V1, which is a unisex um, barefoot running cross training CrossFit style shoe. And it's zero drop. And uh, I say CrossFit because you can see the inside of that shoe has got some rope climbing protection. Uh, wore them once just today at the gym. They felt great. I love the zero drop, that flat feeling. I did some, uh, some straight leg deadlifts or Romanian deadlifts or good mornings, you know, where you bend at the waist, work your hamstrings and your glutes. And so having my heel all the way down gave me a further, um, extension of my hamstrings and calf muscles as opposed to having a heel, which would have them like a little tighter, less extended. Uh, so these, um, by contrast, give me a full, gave me a fuller, fuller range of motion, which is one aspect of the zero drop is you get a fuller range of motion just 24 seven, just while you're wearing the shoe because it drops your heel, stretching your calves more so they're not tight or tightened. Um, great shoe. Uh, I'm not being paid by New Balance, and my channel's not even monetized, so I'm getting nothing for this. I don't know why I'm doing it, because I see a lot of shoe reviews, and I'm like, man, I wish someone would review my shoes, and if you're thinking about getting shoes, these are great. This color is aquamarine, green-blue, toxic is what New Balance calls it. It's, uh, it's an iridescent blue-green. Um, it is... Uh, what else? It's just a straight up shell of a shoe. The barefoot minimalist style is nothing but, uh, it's, it's not even like a shoe. It's like a shell, um, which did not feel good without socks. Uh, the bottom of the feet was all right without socks, but the rest of the shoe, since it's not padded like a, sh like a full shoe, um, was uncomfortable on my feet. So I went ahead and put on my, um, my regular kind of slightly thin athletic socks, and they felt great. Um, that's pretty much all I have after just one workout in them. I'm going to do more. I'm going to make some videos using them so you can see, like, I like to see, like, the flexion in the toe. I like to see how, like, the foot moves and the shoe moves. So I'll make a video of that at the gym. Um, otherwise... Totally stoked. They felt great. It's good to be back in a zero balance shoe. The bottom was uh, was not slippery on the rubber surface of my gym. Um, that's all I can think of at the moment. And like I said, I'll be making more videos. Cool. Um, this is not a paid advertisement. I feel like people who are getting paid either by a product companies or Google, YouTube should probably like have to state that. You know, like old magazines. Like, like uh, Flex Magazine would have advertisements that were like three pages and they had to, by law, state somewhere on the advertisement that it was an advertisement. Because it would look like a product review or a, you know, research article, but it was an advertisement and legally they had to state this is a paid advertisement. So I think that's what YouTube is up to, uh, is doing these days because they have violated the law a lot. I, however, am not getting paid by anyone, not even monetizing my channel. Just wanted to give you a look at these shoes to let you know that they're freaking great. I'm stoked. If I have any problems, I'll let you know. But I'm going to make some videos, yada yada.